Welcome to my video tutorial on sharing large files via vSpace. Uh, I'm Bain Bailey, I'm the Media Cloisters Manager. First, to get to vSpace, you can go to the Vassar front page, type in vSpace in the search field. This will automatically bring up the login window. Uh, use your same, should be the same login information that you use for your Vassar vMail. And type in your information and click go. Uh, I have one picture in here. But let's say I have a really large file that's too big to email, which is over 20 megabytes on the Vassar, currently on the Vassar email system. I click Upload. I'm going to Browse. I have something on the desktop that I want to use. Let's say I want everyone, I think everyone should know how to do uh, use RSS. And this is a good one. So I'm going to upload it. And this could take some time. I'm going to pause the recording while it uploads. Okay, so that took a little while. I went away and came back. It was about 15 or 20 minutes. Uh, but now you can see in my vSpace directory, I have two files. Now, I really don't like the name of this file, so I'm going to show you how to rename this. I click on here. Whoops. I, uh, I click on Manage and then I'm going to say rename and we're going to rename this file RSS Reader Tutorial because that's what it really is. It's about how to use RSS. So now let's go back to here and what I want to do is I want to share it and luckily enough there's a share icon. The, look for the little hand so click on that and I'm going to select, I want this to be readable by the public. So that's readable by everyone in the world that has an internet connection. Uh, if I wanted to just be available on the Vassar campus or through the Vassar, Vassar proxy, I would click read. I would uh, use this line. But that's not the case. I don't want other people to be able to write it. And I don't want them to be able to delete it. So I just want everyone to be able to read it, uh, but not be able to mess it up or change it. Click Apply, and now it's public. So now I go back to my uh, root, my files, and I click on this AVI. And I'm trying to find the URL. One moment. So now if I right-click and get the properties of this link, I'll have here. Uh, uh, a URL that I can copy and then send to someone. So if I sent them an email, I would just paste that URL. They would be able to click on that link and see it. Well, thanks for checking out my uh, first take of my uh, screen, my screencasting of how to upload and share a large file using uh, the Vassar vSpace.